coordinator brought, the old coordinator back. Spate throws a slant, has a first down out to the 20 yard line. J.U. Chesson makes the catch. The a corner that's harder on that is going to blow that up. And around Chesson using that speed across the 35. Tripped up by Jamal Mayo's a little slow to get up. And that's why Newsom goes left half. Spade on a post inside the 10-yard line, complete to Chesson. Pretty decent coverage, but a really good throw that time. And this will be reviewed. This is one of the most, it is the most reviewed play. Is was this ball caught or not caught? Let's see if it the player has control through the ground. It looks he does. As long as the ball doesn't touch the ground, he's going down in the action of the play. And that's a catch. To their team is this defensive front. These three guys are good players. Here's Spate. Again, finds a seam and has a man, and Chesson able to make the grab down to the two-yard line. DJ Killings was right there with him. Third and eight. This is a beautifully thrown ball down the field, identifying man-to-man -man coverage. That ball is perfectly thrown to Chesson. Good sign for Michigan and Wilton Spate early. Gain of 35 on the play. All on the UCF end, receiving end, if you will. Wow. And so again, Michigan will take over in great field position. And right away off the, off the block there, they go down the field to Chesson. You can see Spate was rocking out of the entire time. I love this call from Jim Harbaugh, Tim Drevno. Right after a sudden change, you come out, you want to get your quarterback settled in. You want to get some explosive plays. Deep play action off of a running game that's been effective is a great way to do it. I think Chesson's one of the more underrated receivers in the country. Has Michigan in business at the 25 of UCF. Here's Spate. Finds a wide open middle of the field. It's Chesson again who just sat down in that zone. <laughs> Trying to make up for that one. On the sweep, Chesson. With a blocker in front, Chesson turns the corner, touchdown! Of making, he gets that block right there to the next level. Watch his feet. Yeah, that's a nice tight rope. He's clean. Run out of answers. They fake that pitch to Evans and throw it downfield. Open caught. Another first down. Down to the 27. Chesson. <laughs> how, how tall are you again, McShay? Six. Uh, pushing six men. Is that what we're going with? Six one? Six, six, oh, six, six. I think he's Got using it. the same take that Musso did. Chesson has the first down there. Another completion for Spate. Keep in mind, Wisconsin has allowed just three offensive touchdowns all season. Hand it off. To Chesson in the final half minute of the quarter. Now they maintain possession after the penalty. Just over midfield. Here's Spate with a hand in his face, able to complete. Finds Chesson and is brought down at the 25 yard line. Garrett Dooley, but not before the gain of 24. Yeah. Spate up in the pocket again on the launch to the end zone. And it is caught, touchdown! What a grab by J.U. Chesson! Down the sideline for the score. Spate on third down and 11. Flag comes in, a bullet down the middle goes for a first down. It felt the same way and he's carried it here into Michigan. Drake Johnson expected to be added to that mix. He's back and healthy as Spate takes a little contact and stands in to find J.U. Chesson. I think they're playing exceptional today. Spate on play action. Rolling, throwing, diving for the catch is Chesson and a first down to the Illinois 46-yard line. Spate is playing lights out. Let's see if this is a catch all the way through. There's control, he brings it in, doesn't touch the ground. Well done by Jamie Chesson. Second and 17. Somewhere in the state of Michigan, somebody's going, yeah. <laughs> Here's Chesson. Spade, play action. He wants to throw for it. He's got a wide open Chesson, and he drops it in. First down, Michigan. 
And they trust their quarterback. Sure A do. first year starter, but throwing for it on third down, a gain of 23. Yeah, they sure do. And, and I don't know what the safety here is doing. Grayson Miller is back there. We just lose eyes. The number of times we talk about eyes, especially in these pro style systems. Look forward to your explanation, everybody, for window dressing. On third and four, able to complete first down and plenty more. Jehu Chesson into the game. One of the three tight ends on the right side of the screen. All the window dressing, Steve, just to get an open receiver in Jehu Chesson. And Brian, he does a nice job, Spake does, of being patient in the pocket. It also helps when your offensive line's giving you that kind of time. Get the pressure off of Jabril Peppers, top of the screen. Now they'll hand it off to Peppers. He's going to throw back to Spade. Spade looking downfield for Chesson, and he's got him. Well, he, he said he could throw the ball. He did it a lot in high school. Let's take a look at his arm here. You got to make sure you throw it backwards. <laughs> he just checked that off. Nice. Gave him enough time, and Spate finds Chesson downfield for the big play. On third and four, Spate steps up and now throws. Wide open. Touchdown, Jehu Chesson. Simply amazing. Just as I said, Jake Butt's a great pass pro. Watch, he gets beat, of course. But a great double move on the outside by Chesson. And you know Jim Harbaugh, right? You know he's going to continue to attack, even though it's his buddy on the other side and DJ Durkin, their repertoire. Spate to throw. It's Chesson. First down yardage. Collaborative, and he's got that big NFL-style play sheet. Here's play action. Spate has it. Loops it downfield. Chesson makes the catch down near the 20. J.U. Chesson as they get deep for the first time tonight. Well, Jake Butt in the middle takes two defenders with him, and it opens it up completely for Chesson. That, that's, that's the backup safety there, Gare, who's trying to slow down Chesson there, but it opened up in the middle because a safety and a linebacker occupied with Jake Butt. And we and then we'll see, as you referenced, Greg, what happens here with Michigan, and then certainly Clemson today with Wake. Third down and long for O'Corn, and that pass on target. It's caught, but close to a first down is Chess, and he did. 52 yards on that punt. Wolverines from there, 37. It's Darbo in motion. Spate looks back to the near side and delivers a strike. And the catch is made by J.U. Chesson, the senior. On the end around. And hand it off to Chesson and tries to cut back. And another little wrinkle there. That's a play that's hurt Ohio State at times this season. Yeah, it sure has. Summer camp, Christmas camp. And that's the way Harbaugh and Michigan have been doing it down here. Giving the younger guys the great bowl experience, they say, and getting them ready for next season. Again, it's Chesson. And he has enough for the first down. Marquez White down to get some kind of momentum going at the end of this first half. Chesson's been reliable all season. The ball's thrown a little bit behind. If Marquez White had his head around, could have knocked that football down, but it's a first down for Michigan at the 44. I think that's six. Instead, tough turn of events. It's third and 11. Right back and caught. J.U. Chesson that time makes the grab in this game, but this one is right on the money. I thought that was the best throw he's had all night. He was decisive, top of the drop, saw what he wanted, and knew he could fit it in, even though it was a very, very tight window. Game of 15.